Hey everyone, welcome back to MNMA Miles. This is Manmohit. Now guys, in today's video, I am going to continue that video series that I started for doing the IELTS general reading questions for the given paragraphs. In the previous video, we did from 22 to 29. And in this video, we are going to look at question numbers 30 to question numbers 36. And this one is going to be with a different paragraph or a different set of paragraphs, I would say. Now, if we look at the question first, what it says is complete the summary below of the first two paragraphs of the reading passage. Choose one or two words from the reading passage for each answer. Write your answers in box 30 to 36 on our answer sheet. So we have to make sure we always read out the question first that the answer can only be either one word or it can be a maximum of two words. What they have given is they've given us a paragraph with a few blanks in that. And this paragraph is basically the summary of the above given passages. So our job is to just make sure the words that we are picking up, they have to be from the paragraphs itself. We cannot use any synonyms or any words from our side. We might have to change the sequence of the words or try to paraphrase and see which word fits the best. But we have to pick something from the paragraphs itself. First one has already been done for us. If we look over here, what it says is from the point of view of recycling, paper has two advantages over minerals and something over here. So paper, which is my keyword, has two advantages over minerals is one thing and dash, let's say, is another thing. If I go to the paragraphs over here, let's try to read out where it says the word paper, minerals and dash. It says paper is different from other waste produced because it comes from a sustainable resource trees, unlike the minerals and oil used to make plastics and metals, trees are replaceable. So it's the same thing, but said in a different way, because this is a summary. So it has been paraphrased is that paper has two advantages. Yes, paper is better than what minerals and another thing they said was oil. So this is what we are looking to do. So like we do in all the videos, what you can do is when you read out the sentence in the fill in the blanks and when I display these paragraphs, you can pause the video and then try to solve that answer by yourself. Try to first figure out, pause the video and figure out which do you feel is the correct answer and then play the video, resume the video and see what answer did we pick and where did we get our answer from. Let's look at the question number one. It says in that firstly, it comes from a resource, which is dash. Now all the answers are going to be in sequence. So that's a good thing. Let's start from the very first sentence. It says paper is different from other ways produced because it comes from a sustainable resource. So basically they have given me the answer in my very first line that paper is different from the other ways produced because it comes from a sustainable resource. And this is exactly what they have said over here that firstly, it comes from a resource, which is sustainable. In the paragraph, they said sustainable resource. And over here, they have said a resource, which is sustainable. So one and the same thing next. And secondly, it is less threatening to our environment when we throw it away because it is dash. So if you look at the paragraph again, after reading after that sentence, unlike the minerals and oil used to make plastics and metals, trees are replaceable. Paper is also biodegradable. So it does not pose as much threat to the environment when it is discarded. So here they have just shuffled the sentences, but they say is paper does not pose as much threat to the environment when it is discarded because it is dash. That's what my blank said. So my answer would be biodegradable. So I'm just going to write down the answer just on the right hand side, just so it's easier because it is biodegradable. Next one, number 32, although Australia's record in the reuse of waste paper is good, it is still necessary to use a combination of recycled fiber and dash to make new paper. So we're looking for the keywords over here, combination of recycled fiber. That's one thing. And we're also looking for another thing and to combine them and make some new paper. Let's have a look. So again, I'll continue reading from that point onward. While 45 out of every 100 tons of wood fiber used to make paper in Australia comes from waste paper, the rest comes directly from virgin fiber. 
which is from the forest and plantation uh, plantations by world standards this is a good performance since the worldwide average is 33% waste paper so that means 45 out of every tons of wood fiber is used to make paper in australia which comes from the waste paper and the rest is coming directly from the virgin fiber and here what they're saying is recycled fiber and the second thing to make new paper number 32 would be virgin fiber next number 33 the paper industry has contributed positively and people have also been encouraged by dash encouraged by something to collect their waste on a regular basis so we are looking for who were the people encouraged by so let's go back to the same paragraph and we'll continue reading on from the virgin fiber by world standards this is a good performance since the worldwide average is 33 percent waste paper governments have encouraged waste paper collection so waste paper collection means collecting the waste paper and sorting schemes and at the same time the paper industry has responded by developing new recycling technologies that have paved the way for even greater utilization of used fiber so government have encouraged the waste paper collection so that means people have also been encouraged by government right to collect their waste on a regular basis waste collection or collect their waste is one and the same thing next number 34 one major difficulty is the removal of ink so these are my keywords removal of ink from used paper so that's the difficulty but dash are being made in this area but something is being made in that area so we're looking for these keywords difficulty removal of ink and we'll get our answer from there The paper industry has responded by developing this is done as a result industry's use of recycled fiber is expected to increase at twice the rate already waste paper constitutes 70 percent of paper used for packaging and advances in the technology required to remove ink from the paper have allowed a higher recycled content in news print and writing paper so again what they have done is they have paraphrased that same sentence but what they were trying to say over here is what has happened there have been advances in the technology to remove ink from the paper have allowed a higher recycled content so there has been advancement in the technology so what we can say is one major difficulty is the removal of ink from newspaper but advances so number 34 would be advances are being made in this area so they have made advancement in the technology in that area and now that difficulty of removal of ink is getting better next number 35 however we need to learn to accept paper which is generally of a lower something than before we need to learn to accept so let's go back over here to achieve the benefits of recycling the community must also contribute we need to accept here it is we need to accept what a change in the quality of paper products for example stationery may be less white and of a tougher texture so that means we have to compromise we have to accept that a change in quality will happen that means a lower quality will happen and they've already used the word lower which is generally of a lower so number 35 would be quality and the last one and to sort our waste paper by removing dash before discarding it for collection so we are looking for these keywords that we have to sort our waste paper by removing something before discarding it for the collection so i'll keep continue reading from this point onwards there are also needs to be support from the community for waste paper collection programs not only do we need to make the paper available to collectors but it also need to be separated into different types and sorted from contaminants such as these are examples staples paper clips string and other miscellaneous items so we have to sort the paper from contaminants so contaminants has to be my answer that means sort our waste paper by removing contaminants before discarding it for collection so i hope this made sense so I, as you can see all the words that i have used over here are exactly the same words that were given in the paragraph i know they have paraphrased this sentence Para paraphrase these, this particular paragraph, this summary, but 
as the question said, we are not to paraphrase or use synonyms for the words. We have to use the exact same words that were given to us in the passages itself. I hope this video was helpful. I would still be coming up with the other videos as well and I would try to complete all the questions of this particular exam paper. These are Cambridge questions. So keep an eye out for that. If you have any questions regarding this video, feel free to put them down in the comment section below. Or if you want some specific content, let's say you were struggling in that topic or this topic and you want us to make a video based on that one to clarify, you can also post your video ideas with the topic ideas in the comment section below. And then me and Mohit can prioritize them and make videos based on those topics as well on a priority basis. God bless all of you. Stay safe wherever you are. And I will see you all in the next video.